La -ti -ti -ta -ti -ta -ti. Candylicious? Miss Independent? How are you doing? Hmm, so where are those fantastic creatures from your list, Sue? You're looking at them. Say hi to the girls again. And then we're gonna throw a themed pajama party. What do you mean? Where are Pikachu and the others? All right, I got it. We're gonna sew cute pajamas for them. Exactly. Do you want a jammy too? I can make one for you. Nope. We have to dress up four dolls. No time for ourselves. Take this. Okay, let's get started. I have paper patterns for all the pieces of each outfit. Trousers go first. We'll outline the shape. Sammy, help me with the other colors. Got it. Ugh, these are blending. I believe in you. Here is the first outline. Now let's carefully cut out the shape. That's easy. I wouldn't be so... Just like this, the first fleece piece is ready. We're going to deal with the other ones in the same way. sewing machine. Hey, Susie, you stole my thread. Oops, will you help me? Mm, no. Ha, <laughs> just kidding. Guys, we'll start sewing. If you're unsure, ask an adult for help. Yay, our first seam. Keep going, Sue. Right, let's continue working on the pants. Don't worry, each seam is Pretty. Give a thumbs up if you agree, guys. Yellow legs and yellow tail. Pikachu is cutest. <gasps> Sammy, come on! We're running out of time. We're having a party with Pikachu, Sammy. Don't be so stiff. We'll make it in time. Look, I'm already sewing the back part of the costume. I am looking very closely. <laughs> Only upside down. But it's fun. Here we go. Go on! Show us something fun, too. After all, we are crafting here. <laughs> if you say so. All right, we're going to need the sleeves. And ta-da! This is what we've got, guys. Susie, I got stuck with the tail. <laughs> Check this out. Seams are nice. Great job, Sammy. Phew! Guys, I thought I'd turn gray before figuring it out. <laughs> guys, it happened for real! Hope oh, I want to be young again! Don't worry, Sammy. You'll become yourself when I finish with the tail. Then tear off this fake beard. I'll sacrifice it for the craft. I'm afraid you're going to need to shave. I'll do it. A no white strand will be left. Guys, we need to sew on the tail. Remember to be careful when working with the needle. Susie, are we going to make a unicorn pajama too? What color? Yep, I'm thinking of a pink one. Awesome. Please continue. I'll be right back. Hmm, he looks suspicious. Anyway, we need to move on. Pikachu also has cute little ears with black tips. We just need to sew these pieces together like this. I'm back, and I've kept some stuff exactly for the situation. Thanks, Sam. Let's fill up the first ear. Sammy, where are you going? Hey, I can have secrets. I want to show her something. Let's go. Guys, we'll solve this mystery later. Let's make another ear. Cool. The last thing we'll make is a hood. It consists of the outer and the inner sides. Here they are. So let's get to this. First, you'll attach the ears and then sew together both sides of it. That's right. And don't forget about the border piece between them. Are you spying on me, Sammy? All right, let's just wrap it up. Wow, looks cool. It totally slaps. In the meantime, I'm going to take Miss Independent for a uh, girl's chat. Sounds mysterious. <laughs> Guys, we'll sew the pajama to the outer side of the hood. Be careful and look out for your fingers. Try not to prick yourselves. Now we can sew up the inner side. This part can be really tricky. Ask an adult for help if needed. Phew, it's the cutest pajama I've ever seen. This is the result. The ends of the sleeves and trousers look messy, though. Oopsie, I thought it was Pikachu style. <laughs> we'll sew the tiny cuffs on these parts, and it won't be a problem anymore. Here comes some Velcro for a comfortable wear. 
We'll attach it to the front, and that's it. The sleepover party is getting started. Let's get changed. Susie, I've got an idea. Let's spawn in Pikachu with a Pokemon ball. Pikachu, I choose you. Wow, you look gorgeous. Uh, Sue, I think she wants to dance with me. <laughs> wow, Sammy, you even blushed. It's so cute. The red cheeks is a finishing touch for this outfit. Get ready for a pajama dress. Aha! Uh -huh. You're vibing here while I'm up to my ears and work. Sorry, Sammy. I promise the real party won't start without you. Let's keep up with the sewing. The second pajama has cute kitten ears. And that's it. Susie, come on! Hide the ears between the hood layers. I promise I'll keep them safe. And we shouldn't forget about the border piece. It's sewing time. Wow, Sue, you're so good with the sewing machine. Now we can attach it to the pajama dress. Ahem. I proudly present to you the best piece of craftsmanship. Wow, Sammy, you did great. It even has a pocket on the front. Guys, you're already familiar with this process. Let's get started. Do you remember how to make the cuffs? Let's add them to the sleeves and the hem. You know, I won 100 battles with other Pokemon. Wanna fight me, huh? Susie, wait, I haven't finished yet. Um, hello? Ah! What is going on, Sue? I just thought that you would want to dress her up yourself. After all, you designed this. Here is your pajama! Hey, why are you peeking? Close your eyes, everybody. Wow, she looks perfect, right, Sue? Guys, check out this cute kitty. She can't wait for the party. Susie, it's all her fault. She dressed up herself. Almost all the guests have arrived. Pikachu, Kitty, and uh, Sammy, I don't recognize her. Holy cannoli, it's my fault. I took the decor to play for a bit and I got carried away. Finally, it's nice to meet you, little unicorn. You know, Sam didn't want to invite you. Hey, I thought you were talking about a real unicorn. Ah, this is the last guest. Wait, I'm coming. Guys, who do you think it will be? I'm getting excited. We have one more kitty. Welcome to the party. Oh, Shiver Me Cheddars, we have twins. I hope they won't fight. Are they getting ready for a best dress battle? Touch me, it's so easy to leave me. All alone with the memory of my days in the sun. If you touch me, you'll understand what happiness is. Look, a party has begun. Wow, that was the most dramatic start to a party I've ever seen. Girl, don't be sad. You're here to have fun. Now the real party's starting over. I can't believe it. Hi guys, today I'm gonna help Sammy make Barbie dresses for Christmas. Sue, I brought different fabrics. I couldn't choose just one. Why do we need fabrics when we have the balloons they sent you by mistake? Ladies and gentlemen, give a thumbs up for no sew and no glue dresses. That's right. First, we'll cut off the tip of the red balloon and then we'll get rid of its bottom part like this. Guys, be very careful with the scissors. It's not a toy. Don't be shy to ask an adult to help you. Wow. La, 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 la. Sue, 
Ooh, that dress came out so stylish. It's awesome. You think we're done here? We're just getting started. Let's add more Christmas details to that dress. We need to make a white strip like this. Interesting. You know, that reminds me of something. I just can't figure out what it is. It's on the tip of my tongue. Look closely, you still have some time to guess. Now let's make this tiny but very important detail. There. And with a slight movement of hand, it turns out to be a stylish black belt. I know! This dress looks absolutely like those gorgeous dresses from Mean Girls! You're absolutely right, Sammy. And here is a perfect silver buckle. But there is a catch. I promised our Barbies they'd get unique dresses. We can easily fix this. Let's spice things up with a bright boa. It was here. I remember it was. Come on, where is it? That's strange. Did you lose something again, Sue? Thanks for finding it, Sammy. But I think it suits our Barbie better than you. What do you think, guys? Give us a thumbs up if you agree. There's no outfit without posh shoes. That's exactly what we need. Let's put them on. Oh. The style icon's advice is worth his weight in gold. And thank you very much, Mr. Extraordinary Taste. The dress turned out wonderful. You can tell it's made by a very gifted fashion designer. Oh, Sammy, you're making me blush. <laughs> Guys, I bet you want to check out our first outfit properly before we move on to the next one. Sue! You started without me! It's unacceptable! Is <laughs> something wrong, Sammy? Don't you trust me in matters of style? I do! How could you say that? But everything should be done under my strict supervision, you know? Okay, go ahead. Evaluate my work. Hmm. Alrighty. Ahem. <clears throat> well... I officially declare that this is an absolutely wonderful, amazing, super cool dress! Is it just me, or is there a but? But it doesn't look like a Christmas dress. It's more like a pretty outfit. Don't worry, Sammy. Everything is thought through. Check this out. That idea is 100% amazing. I know, right? And I suggest completing this look with these great shoes. I agree. Awesome! For the third look, we need red and green balloons and scissors. Let's start with the red one. First step, cut off the tip. Then we'll fold it in half and make a little cut here. This way, we get a wonderful top. Sue, what's that? You were supposed to make something fabulous, not just the top. Sammy, as a future designer, I should say that it's very old-fashioned to think that girls should wear only dresses at Christmas parties. And today, I'm going to prove that. Let me just make another cut. Ugh, that's a tough one. What are you doing there, Sammy? I've devised the formula of a perfect party outfit. If your experiment meets all the criteria, I'll accept it. Deal. <laughs> now let's fold half of this white balloon and make one more cut. Remember to be super careful, all right? Just like this. And one more time. Here we go. Perfect. It's not done yet, but no one can deny that it'll look very elegant. Nice collar. Check. By the way, as you can see, Sammy, I made the outfit to fit her body. So... I can take a hint, Sue. For a special occasion, you don't only have to wear a dress. Try whatever you want. Trousers or even shorts. And how do you like these boots, Sammy? It's a score. So guys, what do you think? 
If you approve of our experiment, give us a thumbs up! We'll start the new dress just like we did many times before. Guys, we've already made some dresses out of balloons. And you know where to find those videos! On our channel, of course. If you haven't seen them, subscribe to our channel so you don't miss anything anymore. I don't get it! Why did you make those strips? Oh, that's actually really simple. They will serve as straps. You'll see later. And the rest will make a dress itself, right? Exactly. Now let's add some style. It's going to be a fur trim. I think it's a great decision for a Christmas party dress. Sue, so I've been thinking, maybe I also need to dress up somehow? That hat is interesting. Do you have something more, you know, classic? I think something black tie will do. I have a black tie? Check it out! Black tie is not an item of clothing. <laughs> it's a type of dress code. White tie stands for the most formal type, while black tie is less formal. The main rule is not to wear very bright shades. Well, is it good now? You always look perfect, Sammy, but now even more. And our doll needs some shoes, right? Susie, that dress is my favorite. What do you say, guys? This is going to be our last outfit for today, guys. It will be very interesting and not so simple. Let's take a green balloon. Watch me do it, guys. Of course, it's not going to be that difficult if you follow me and do everything neatly and carefully. Like this. Phew! What will it be? Me? Don't distract me. Where did I stop? Oh, right. Now we need to fold our balloon like this. Guys, don't worry. If you make a mistake, you can just take another balloon and start over again. But it's better when things work out on the first try. And this is what you should get. It looks like a funny monster face, as if it's screaming like, ah! Sam, please stop making such a noise. I need to concentrate. Here we go. Let's try it on. How do you like it? She looks like a little red riding hood, only in a green tank top. We'll make the rest of the dress from a different balloon. Sue, so what about choosing the right shoes? But I'm not finished yet. Guys, sometimes he gets carried away. If you ask me, I say this will go great with that dress. But Sammy, this is going to be a Christmas party, so it takes place in the winter. But it's so bright outside! I've read everything about snow and it reflects light, you know? Okay, but I don't think glasses fit the style. Do you have another idea for accessories? Hmm, I don't know. Can we make a ribbon from this balloon? Great! Thanks, Sammy. And that's all we're gonna need. But don't forget to measure the length first. Perfect. You're doing it wrong! You wear a ribbon on your head, not on your hands! You gave me an idea with this balloon. It's perfect for making longer sleeves. It's hard to admit, but your idea is cooler than mine. Guys, check this out. We cut little holes for her thumbs here. I'm looking at the dress and I literally can hear it calling for some decorations. And I can make some! Bibbidi bobbidi subscribity! What do you think, Sue? Love it, as well as these shoes. Now you're talking! And we're almost done. Is everybody ready? It's party time! <laughs>